Hi, my name is Jason Gardner. We offer 85% recycled steel buildings that are 100% metal, which are obviously a better product for numerous reasons. Number one, you don't have mold rot. They're recyclable. 100 years down the road when no one wants this building no more, we can tear it down and recycle every piece of this building. The drywall, the concrete, and the steel. They're, we can get them fire resistant with proper architectural. We can get them to where they have a substantial amount of fireproofing to where if you had products inside your home that you don't want to lose, they would be safe. Me personally, they're some of the best buildings you can build. They come from a commercial standpoint in the design of them, which has brought me to lots of problems and I think has stopped a lot of people thinking like this, is that you have a commercial builder that's not used to the custom steel that we do. Most of the buildings are kit homes or in the commercial world are post beam where the metal studs are infills, where this here building actually holds the, its own load. So they're just like a wood building except made out of metal and concrete. How much experience do you have doing this and what do you think makes you better than other similar contractors? I've been at this for 13 years and I can say for experiences what did it for me was the roofs. Most metal framers have problems with the roofs. Uh, in wood, you can take a wood if something ain't right and you can just cut it. Metal studs and these metal trusses, they have to be precise. This building here had uh, maybe 600 individual truss pieces that had to be located just right or the building does not work right. And I've had them up to 1,400 pieces on one roof. It's where in a wood building, uh, they'll actually come out and customize and build it themselves right there like a custom home. Where we actually get them delivered to us and they have to go right there. It takes a lot of time. I've been at this for 13 years and there's a lot of builders out there, but they're mostly commercial. I'm one of the only builders in Northern California that does custom metal homes, meaning that we get raw stock material. It's not a kit, and we actually build right from scratch, custom. They're great homes. I advise everybody gets this, and I think I can build some great homes for people. Any downsides as opposed to modular or regular wood construction? Uh, downsides, the cost of the material is more expensive. But I'm not much of a salesman, but if I had to put it in a simple form, I would say when I go car shopping and I want a car that gets 50 miles to the gallon, I'm not going to go buy a Suburban. If I want a car that gets 50 miles to the gallon, I'm going to go buy a Prius. Meaning that you're getting what you pay for in one of these. They might be a little more money. That's the worst downside too. It's a little more costly to build them, but you get a better building. And as far as fire protection, suppose we're talking to people in San Diego, mm -hmm. how significant would be the difference? How much more protected would they be? Huge. Huge difference. Uh, I mean, if uh, there was a fire right there in a building which is 15 feet away from us right now, and that building was burning, this building here, if it had a little bit different than the construction here, just a little bit different, the same construction, just a little different on uh, exterior, uh, you could stand right here and it could be... 10,000 degrees over there and stuff in this building would be fine. But it's still possible, as you said, there is a little chance that it, there, is, there is a fire. Because what happens in steel is the uh, connections get hot and it pops and it twists. So if you get a connection like this, it'll pop and twist. But say you were in a forest fire, which they'll get super hot, the worst thing I could say if I built a building for you, the worst thing that would happen to you in a forest fire is that cosmetically I would have to fix your home up. Fascia, exterior boards, smoke damage, uh, as far as the things inside your home, it'd have to get really hot before you'd have to burn the paint or burn the carpet in your home without a constant flame on it. How long does it take for you to put together, let's say, a 3,000 feet uh, single family home? What would you estimate? Rough frame, I can do them in 11 weeks, as long as they're, uh, say, a single story ranch. That I can do in about 11 weeks rough frame. Um, the whole building, the, I would say a whole building in matter on, you have a lot of other people that are working, you have subs like electro electricians and mechanical, concrete, structural, uh, they can drag out to six, seven months. Okay. So that I, I think they're just the same as wood. You know? If somebody wanted to contact 
you. What would be the best way to get a hold of you to get more information? My cell phone number is 530-903-7268 or you can go to www.andersonsteelframing.com and that's one of my affiliates. At, so he does the engineering and trusses. Okay. So you could go there and uh, he's got his info there too. And okay. he's out of Arkansas. Excellent. Perhaps your, uh, your co-worker can add anything? You have any, a few words? Yeah, not to mention all the, the naturals like termites and black mold and all that's non non-existence because there is no wet, no water damage, nothing like that. Plus, it's always going to stay straight because it ain't going to get warped over time and stuff like that. So additional savings, I assume, right? Quality, less headaches, more exactly. savings down the line. And as you said earlier, the bottom line is that in the long run, you actually save money. You save money in the you long run. You get what you pay for. Yeah. You get what you pay 50 for. Fifty years down the road, this building will look totally different than the uh, building that was built 50 years ago out of wood. Mm -hmm. This building will still be straight, solid, and hard. And that's what it is about. Yeah, that's what it's about. The long well, term of it. That's the whole building of it. You know, you can recycle. Uh, we need to look at the 100 years down the road with our buildings. Of course. Not to mention we need the trees for our oxygen in the air. Everything. Yes, yeah, of course. Need, of course. It's always a good thing. Well, thanks guys. I appreciate your help and hopefully more people will contact you and we'll do great business. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.